Hello and welcome to this short tutorial video from Production Assist. In this video, we want to show you how to set parameters of spotlights with Production Assist. I select a fixture. The Object Properties tab opens on the left, where you can select the editing functions for all object properties and dependencies. We begin with the name and the object ID. I can also select the class and, if necessary, the layer. Both can also be controlled using the navigation. Here are the specifications that have already been set up. I then see here the name of the assembly group. And I can simply enter a name here instead of adopting the default numbering of the assembly group. For example, Truss2. Furthermore, I can assign a color code. These are created in advance in the navigation. It primarily stands for a rough assignment of the objects. Useful above all for easier recognition on trucks or even at the venues, when unloading or shunting the components. In addition, I can even assign the objects to their respective departments for later paperwork, using color codes. Now let's go to the drop-down menu here below, which deals with all the parameters. Of particular interest regarding the spotlights, are the three lower drop-down lists – Fixture Data, Fixture Design and Electric and Data. Here we'll take a look at the Fixture Data settings. There you can change the Fixture ID, which was automatically assigned a default object ID here. Further below, you can adjust the mode, the absolute, the universe, the address and the DMX footprint. In mode, you are presented with a selection which, of course, is related to the fixture that has been installed. If a mode is not available, you can simply enter one, as I do here. You see Add, preceding the name you enter. Hit Enter and the Add New Mode window pops up. Here you can then enter various footprints. Remember, fixture properties can be set using drop-down menus, fixture data, fixture design and electric and data. Fixture data stands for the basic parameters such as DMX mode and footprint. You can enter multiple footprints for each fixture. We will be happy to answer even more questions in the next video. Thank you for your attention.